Hi, Martin here. Today I want to do a quick walk around on this Pratt & Whitney. It's, it's an 1800 horsepower engine that's been derated down to uh, 1200 horse. And uh, the, we had a little mechanical problem with it. And that's why the cowl is all off of here. In fact, I had the honor of helping to take the bottom portion of that off. And uh, it ended up being, uh, I think they call it a DC controller. Is that correct? DCU yeah, it's, it's I, I'd call it a glorified voltage regulator, <laughs> you know. And uh, what was the price tag on that? Like fifty grand? Is that correct? Eight thousand for that, twenty-two thousand for the start gen. Yeah, that, see, uh, and then we also uh, replaced the start generator on it. Uh, it's a start generator combo, and that was twenty-two grand. Um, for most of us, that we'd be like, what, <laughs> you know? And because, uh, you know, we're used to putting a, uh, what, $150 starter in our vehicles, right? And to have a $22,000 part like that, that's just insane. But we got it figured out. Got the mechanic here. He, we got it. And uh, I just want to do a, like a quick walk around of this engine. It's just incredible to see it with the cowl off of it. I mean, I expected actually something bigger. So it's amazing that the size of it and the horsepower this thing can generate. Now this is in a Epic LT. This is uh, technically a experimental airplane. And you would never even dream that this is an experimental aircraft um, when you look at it. It's amazing. It's all carbon fiber. Every bit of this exterior, the cowl, the wings, the fuselage, all of it. And uh, price tag of this one was at 4.5 million. Now the certified ones are out now and they're at $5 million. Now, like I say, I wanna do a, uh, just a walk around on this engine. Um, all right, let's get started. Now I technically don't know a lot about these engines. I know a few of the pieces here. Um, now this engine is, it's mounted in here backwards uh, compared to a typical jet engine. So the air flow is coming in right through here pulls it into here and then there are fan blades basically like a torque converter so there's no mechanical attachment between the fan blades on this side and the ones on this side so you can right here I'm gonna see I'm moving the prop very easily so there's no mechanical attachment between this half of the engine and the other now the uh, DC control unit, the box with the big price tag was this unit right here. And then we got two batteries. I believe these are both 24 volt batteries. There's one on this side, one on the other. So with this engine, the air is coming in this way. You'll see, I might get a video of uh, when we get the cowl back on uh, you can, there's a big scoop right up here draws the air in right in here and then back this way and then it's also using the the exhaust this might be a little bit warm that's a tad warm we had just fired this up a few minutes ago as thrust as well Oh, yeah, I can kind of see that DC or uh, the start gen right there. All right, right here, we got the fuel injectors. Right here, there's quite a few of them. They go all the way around the engine. And then we got two igniters, similar to what you'd find, uh, you know, like in a diesel engine. And they uh, turn off after the engine's fired.
don't think there was any screws holding because it was it did get held up but when i removed all the screws, yeah it was right? getting held up on those lights on the front yeah. i don't want to rest this thing on, on those lights oh. playing operation yeah oh, yeah go back a little bit back yeah then start lifting up yeah i'm gonna hit the prop yeah. here we're gonna lift the back up up first we're gonna try it this way Okay. Push up a little bit. No, I'm I'm into the prop here. In the prop. Okay. Yeah. Back up. I think I, I maybe I got to get my end in first. Okay. Kind of. Yep. Like that. That. Now you can maybe come up. Or I can't tell. Well, it's hitting legs. the nose. It's hitting the nose. Here. You got to back up a hair. I think well, you got to get this side first. The back side. So? Back side on first. Okay. Yeah, I think. Yeah. All right. And yeah, just try to come up. Oh, we're stuck on the gear again. All right. It's got to move. Okay. See, I'm well into the prop right here. Hold up, I'm stuck on something. Give me a sec. I'm oh, trying to remember how we got this thing off. See, see where I'm into the prop here? Like yeah. a couple inches. Yeah, we're, and we have room to come back here too. Yeah, but can you push something it? is holding. Well, I think that those doggone lights there in the front are holding us up. The lights? Okay. Yeah. Oh, you can't go back, huh? So well, we I'm get, actually, now I'm all of a sudden a little closer. It. It's like when you dropped. But the spinner is still in the way. You got to get it behind the spinner. Yeah. Like, there we go. Oh. There we go. Okay. Yeah, just don't Better. Force, just don't force anything. No, I'm not. Am nope. I stuck on something? Yeah. Because my side is not as in. Let's see, I'm probably hanging up on that light, I would imagine. No, not too bad. I don't think. I can't quite see it. Oh, oh uh, yeah, kind of. Drop, drop your end. Drop. drop. Yeah. Who are you talking to? Uh, I don't remember your name. I feel Daryl. 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 Drop a. There we go. Yeah. That's, well, that works for me. I think I'm getting in now. Are we past the lights? Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. I think, yeah. There we go. Yeah. Nailed it. That I looks really cool. My side <laughs> has to come up a little bit more. Am I stuck on something? Yeah, it looks like we're a little crooked. Yeah, your side is low. How's that? Um, it still looks crooked to me. Drop your side a little bit, Daryl? Yeah. There, 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 there we, we go. go. Now That's looking sharp up. here. Yep. Go ahead and put in those fasteners in, Daryl. It's cool. Yeah, I got to wide. Well, folks, we got there it back go. in there. We had just about as much trouble getting it out of here when we when we did take it out of here. And uh, we want to be really super careful with this. I mean, it's all carbon fiber. I can't even imagine the price tag on this if we had to replace it. Um, probably what more than we make in a year. Let's put it that way. <laughs> You want to screw it down? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I know. Did you get all the electrical connections and stuff like that? No. Yeah. That, you still got to get that from underneath? Yeah. Okay. Well, you can let go of the nose now. All right. All right. Well, we got that back on. Now, the we still got to put the top cowl on. And right now, the mechanic and Daryl are working on buttoning up a few things on the bottom side here. There's uh, these flaps are the doors for the front wheel there's a linkage for that that they're hooking up and there's an electrical connection for the light that shines on the wing uh, that's got to be hooked up and a couple other little things so uh, we'll get the top cowl put on here in just a few minutes yeah now this is your air intake and that looks pretty badass huh Here you can actually see the carbon fiber. And this is all handmade. All right, we're getting the uh, top portion of the cowl here in position. I'm I'm the catcher. <laughs> all right, you ready? Yeah. Okay, I got it. Alright, I'm about lined up. You ready? 
Just go ahead and nicely set it down. Uh -huh. Set it in. Watch your fingers. Yep. All right, I'm down. I'm not. I mean, it's down, but not on the. Yeah, it's not lined up. Really. Oh, it needs to come a little more. It needs to rotate. Oh. Ready? Watch your fingers. Yeah. Yep. All clear. Looks like yeah, it needs to that? go back a little bit. Is that, is that what it is? Bit. Yeah. It needs to come back. There, oh, there we go. Closer. There go. I'm lined up over there. here. There. Now I got this sitting on the seam, but I still need to come back. There. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Right there. Push these pluggers in. Yeah, that side's up a bit, but I think we just press down on it. Yeah. Um, check my red. Now we're going to be firing this up in a little bit too then, or? You go fly it. Sweet. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to take it up for a quick test flight. That? Just hop in the front right so you can work on yourself. Okay. Mm -hmm. 